Hey there guys and welcome back to Infamous. In the last part we uh, regained the awesome lightning storm power and we charged up all the substations. So the city is back online. All the power is restored and mission complete. So what do we do now? Don't see anything on the mini-map so I guess we just wait. Just Clean found out what city. Kessler wanted with Sasha. He's milking her like a damn cow. Turning her mind control tar into a gas-based toxin. 41 seconds. Those two psychos were made for each other. Yeah, they're freaks, believe me, I know. But if Kessler succeeds in spraying the city with his toxin, he could take control of every person still here. And send them after you. 18 seconds. Story of my life. I think he's gonna try and deliver it via balloons. Head over to the old Blue Canyon building. And how am I supposed to know where this Blue Canyon building is? I have no freaking clue where that is. A couple of engineers just strung a power line from the historic district back over to the neon. Should make it easier for you to move around. Oh yeah, that's convenient. Although, didn't I just fix the bridge that headed over to the neon? Or... Yeah, some guy on TV rambling on about how I suck and I'm a threat to the city and all that crap. And that's a sturdy TV. Oh, what's this? A crap load of evil side missions. Yeah, maybe I'll go and do those first. Because if I do all the evil side missions, I can... Oh crap, that was a landmine. I can unlock the final uh, upgrade for the arc lightning power. Change in assignment. I'm now tasked with protecting a woman named Sasha. She's supposedly researching mind control techniques. Something with a spray or a gel. My gut tells me she's a honeypot, so I'll need to be careful around her. Time for some street justice! Wait, what? Ah! Bitch! You're gonna get it! No one throws rocks at me! I'm just gonna drain you dry for that. Ought to make a freaking example of her, bitch. I have something for you, Cole. I've seized control of their minds. Place them under your control. <laughs> they will do as you do. Go where you go. Use them to wreak havoc against the Bursars. Show them that we're not to be crossed. Wait, so I'm supposed to take on the First Sons with a bunch of civilians by my side. What are they going to do? Throw rocks at them? Yeah, that's going to work. Those guys are super durable and they have freaking guns. Those civilians are only going to get in my way. Holy crap, where did that guy come from? Well, I don't know what they're doing, but at least there will be suitable distractions while I charge up. Oh, they're actually... Eh, let's just do this. That ought to... Take care of the first suns just fine. Lightning storm, oh god, that power is awesome. Makes me feel like I'm god. Ah, uh, no leaving through the gate, damn it. Nope, nope, don't shoot me. Let's see, uh, pretty sure we also massacred most of my minions with that lightning storm, but I really don't care because they were useless civilians. Now, die! Okay, think that is all of them. Or at least the 12 first sons I need to beat the mission. So, alright, more territory for me. And lock out a good side mission. Only three more evil missions to go. You continue to astound me, my love. I can't wait for the whole world to see what we share. What we're capable of. And I can't wait until this psycho bitch leaves me the hell alone. I mean, really. Let's see. Titanic beatdown. Are we gonna beat down Leonardo DiCaprio? Oh, I have always wanted to do that. Ever since I saw Inception. That movie didn't make the slightest bit of sense. I didn't get it. Like, it was so deep that I just completely lost me there. Ah, crap. Jumped over it. God, this makes me feel like freaking Donkey Kong Country Returns where I'm jumping over all the gaps and failing horribly. Uh, uh, no, no! 
Yeah, this definitely feels like Donkey Kong Country Returns. But yeah, this is like close to where we started the game. This is the big ass crater the race sphere made when it blew up. So, or when uh, Cole activated it, or whatever the hell happened to it. Can I get up here somehow? Yes, they have rain pipes. And window frames. Yeah, we can get up this building just fine. Alright. Pretty sure that's a landmine there. Yeah, it is. Screwed you, landmine. I'm not gonna fall for that one again. Let's see now. Oh, I see another evil mission beacon over there. But there's a blast shard over here, so we'll take that. We have 14 more. Let's see, that's another landmine. Nope, that was a bit too close. Oh well, no major damage. Let's see, mission beacon, where? I don't see it, but the evil mission beacon is there, so I'm guessing we'll just go and do that one first then. Titanic beatdown. Sounds interesting. There's a battle brewing between the cursed first sons and the transients. Follow my beloveds. They will show you where to go. Oh yeah, this one. This one might just be the most chaotic side mission in the game. Because over here, there's a gigantic battle going on between the first sons and the dust men. And now... Cole and his Reaper squad are going to get involved as well. So this is one crazy ass battle. Also collect this dead drop. Audio recording of Kessler follows. Test subject number 345A is exhibiting remarkable signs of progress. The pituitary region of the brain has grown by 39%. And small muscle regeneration is nearly instantaneous. I do have some concerns with the lack of proper blood flow to the lower extremities. Oxygen absorption in those areas is off by 3.6%. A rather substantial decrease that could impact the subject's performance. We need to perform more tests. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you didn't catch anything of what Kessler was saying in that recording, but it doesn't really matter because there were subtitles. And yeah. So they have the junk golems of the dustpen and those big pink energy guys from the first suns walking around along with other goons. And I think we have the pink ones down already. So the dustmen are indeed tougher. We just need to take these guys out. Oh yeah, this is a nice way to recharge my energy bar because I don't really see anything nearby that can serve me as a recharge point. Come on, he's almost dead. Oh, quick, shield up. Okay, that one's done for... Oh, there was still someone there. Oh, crap, grenades. Wait, the first sons have jetpack guys? Oh, no, it's those robots. Yeah, those uh, drone things. Okay, they're down. Oh, man, my reapers are dead. Oh, we can drain some power from here. Okay, then. Take him out. Is he almost dead? Yeah, he's dead. Okay, check the radar. See some spots. Oh, it's those drones. Get that one down. They're the ones tossing all these grenades. It's another one down, and now there's only one dot remaining, and it is over here somewhere. Another one of them. And mission complete. Titanic beatdown. Well, it was a Titanic beatdown indeed. And more territory. We already own a third of the historic district. And say bye bye to another good side mission. You're such a wonderful man. So kind. So loving. Soon you'll be rewarded. I hope so. I hope the reward is that she's gonna leave me the hell alone. Let's see. Angry mob. That sounds fun. You know, maybe we get to beat the crap out of an angry mob. And remember this? This is where we were in the first part. Walking over there, hopping over to that bus and stuff. Anyways, we will have to run quite a distance to get over to that next evil mission. Oh, blast shard. Get it, get it. Drop down. Come on, there we go. 
So we will just simply ride the train tracks. Or maybe not. Why am I over going over here again? Was there like a blast chart near here or something? Well, eh, we'll just walk through the city because taking the train tracks is a huge detour. Oh well. Anyways, in the next <coughs> part of Infamous, we will go and do some more evil side missions and hopefully unlock the final stage of Arc Lightning. So, stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.